wa Kenya wavamia Rais William Samoei Ruto kwa njama ambayo imefichuliwa na wandani wake kurekebisha katiba ili muhula wa urais wa mihula miwili wa kudumu kuondolewa. Karibu kwenye taarifa za Eran Midi na kumbuka kusubscribe. Wa Kenya wamestushwa hii leo na habari zilizo gonga vichwa vya habari zikisaga kwenye mitandao ya kijamii kuwa baadhi ya viongozi wakuu katika utawala wa Rais William Ruto wanataka kurekebisha katiba ili mihula ya urais wa muhula miwili uondolewe haya najiri saa chache baada ya mkuu wa nchi Rais William Ruto kuondoka nchini kuelekea Misri Jumatatu tarehe saba mnamo Novemba kulingana na katiba ya Kenya Rais anaruhusiwa kutawala kwa mihula miwili ambayo ni sawa na miaka kumi ikiwa atachaguliwa kwa muhula wa pili hata hivyo baadhi ya viongozi wa nchini Kenya kwanza wamedai kuwa baadhi ya mageuzi yanafaa kufanywa ili Rais William Ruto aweze kutawala kwa zaidi ya mihula miwili walidai kuwa mageuzi haya yanafaa kuwa muhimu kwa sababu kiti cha urais kinapaswa kuzingatia umri wa mtu binafsi lakini si masharti ambayo ametumikia na Jumane tarehe nane Novemba kura ya maoni ilifanywa na chumba moja cha habari ambacho kinafahamika kama kenyans.co.ke ili kujua iwapo kikomo cha mihula wa rais William Ruto kinafaa kuongezwa Ujumbe huo ulikuwa unasema hivi should the president Ruto's term limit be extended alafu wakapeana option pale ambazo zimeandikwa yes or no Washirika walipewa machaguo mawili ya kuchagua na kulingana na chaguzi walizopewa walishiriki na options kusema kwamba yes or no yes ikimaanisha kwamba the term should be extended alafu no ikimaanisha kwamba he or she does not agree hayapani matokeo kulingana na kura ya maoni ya mitandaoni kati ya washirika Asilimia ishirina sita ya washirika walichagua ndio huku asilimia nne ya washirika wakichagua hapana kwa matokeo haya ina maana kwamba watu wengi hawakubaliani na kuongezwa kwa ukomo wa muda. Wacha ni kusome baadhi za reaction za wakenya ambao walikuwa na hisia tofauti tofauti. Right, siku hii imekuwa ni siku yenye visanga na vimbuanga. Wakenya wameshuhudia makubwa wengi wakilalamika kuhusiana na swala hili. Pale kwenye mitandao ya, ya Twitter ama mtandao wa Twitter eh, kuna mkenya hapa anafahamika kama Aji Mbeyang Farm ambaye alisema hivi, As long as Rigathi is fine with it, I have no say. Alafu kuna mwingine anafahamika kama vile nini? Alisema Nikt anamkumanisha kwamba alikasirika. Jose Kanja yeye akasema please Kenyans be patient. Alafu kuna King Kalala ambaye alisema kama umevote yes wewe ni umbwa sana. Mm, alafu kuna mwingine hapa ni vile nini akaritweet pale akasema kwamba what has caught my attention is the 26 that is agreeing to those cult. Mhm. Wakenya wana machungu mengi zaidi. Alafu kuna Bentex Musembi mbaya alisema hivi, double double and it is very funny. The man has not even done any of the things he said in his manifesto yet. He is already asking for more terms. Alafu kuna jamaa hapa mbaya anafahamika kama EBWS mbaya retweet hivi, testing the waters. Mhm. Alafu kuna Aisha Masharia ambaye alitoa wazo lake pale kwenye Twitter akisema we reward a good leader another term 5 plus 5 years not a life limit up to 75 we want also other community to lead us i am tired of haka niketu mhm le dama kaditweet pale katoa mchango wake akisema yes to be lifetime president Alafu kuna mkenya hapa anajulika kama Ojuang Ojuang Juni ambaye alisema no 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 
alafu Festus Gona akasema still we put him on the weighing balance we can't decide now and regret forever most most please alafu Bontex Msembi vile vile akaja pale huyu uh, anasumbua sana akasema kwamba when we were told William Ruto is dangerous to Kenya we thought it was a joke now things are planning to turn democracy on a test dictatorship smelling Mwisho kabisa anafahamika kama Tengele KP ambaye alitoa wazo lake akisema kwamba just like the BBI anything going against the will of the people should be condemned strongly i say no Umeona jinsi ambavyo wa Kenya wana machungu mengi zaidi Ningependa sana wewe kama mwana Eran Media utoe wazo lake kuhusiana na swala hili Je Ruto anafaa kuongezwa hatamu za uongozi ama zile tamu ambazo anafaa kuongoza zitolewa kutoka muongo mmoja hadi miaka kumi na tano. Ningependa sana utoe mchango wako hapo kwenye comment section lakini zidi kusubscribe hii ni Eran Media Kituo number 1 kwa elimu, habari na hata burudani. Narejea taarifa zingine usikwende mbali.